Good morning. This is what I look like in the mornings now. Just accept it. Love me for who I am. La -di da. Welcome to vlogging. Daily I'm doing it. And I don't have an intro song. So this is it. Welcome and in okay. enjoy it. Bye. Hi. It's Friday. And Abby and I want to do a dairy day. I try and do this every six months. I sometimes have a little dairy, take a little lactate. But I haven't gone full out on a meal with dairy uh, since Europe. And I try and do this every six months, so I should have done it in December, but just life got away from us. And then today, I think I wanna do it. For those who don't know, and you wanna know, because everyone's very interested in other people's eating habits so that you can either judge or scold or follow along or just probably judge. I believe it was five or six years ago, I went full vegan and I liked it, but I was very limited. Like you can't go out and you can't do things. And then when I became single and was gonna start dating again, I was like, you know what? I wanna make it easy that I can just go to any restaurant and and order something so I decided I'm going to put eggs and fish back in my diet but not land meat or dairy so I claim to be a dairy free pescatarian a lot of times I do the don't ask don't tell situation great concept it's not but um I'm going to eat I won't ask if like the fish is cooked in butter versus oil if I my stomach starts hurting it was butter and I take a lactate it's just how I live my life and this it's not a diet this lifestyle works very well for me you can eat what you want this is how I eat but uh, when I went to Europe I ate dairy there because hello. But also uh, their dairy there doesn't give people with lactose intolerance issues because they don't process it a bunch. So I dairy all in Europe and then I haven't had a really whole dairy splurge since. So it's been seven, eight months. I wanna eat some dairy again and today's the day. So I very rarely get urges for foods anymore that I don't eat, but man, when I do, I write it down. We have a whole list of foods that we're eating today. And it's starting off with, for breakfast, a Mexican pizza from Taco Bell with beans instead of beef. So I'm not eating meat still. I was just at the gentle farm yesterday. Relax. I don't think I'll ever go back to eating meat except fish. I just cuddled a cow. How could I do that? Anyway, but I will be consuming dairy for today. And I don't need your judgments. And I don't need your ridicule because this is my body, not yours. Let's have some fun today. I ordered my pizza. My Mexican pizza. <laughs> When's the last time you had one? I don't remember. I used to get them all the time as a kid. Oh, no. <laughs> oh she doesn't want you to film me. Oh, sorry. Thank, Thank you. you. Yay. Wee Can we eat? I'm pulling up and eat, taking yeah. a bite. I want it fresh. Okay. Taco Bell's way better fresh. Dee -dee -dee. I'm so excited, you just can't hide it. <laughs> oh my Hi. goodness, my childhood is rushing back to me. Oh God. All right, wait, first stop. Oh yeah, can't forget. Do you want me to survive the rest of the day? I gotta take my lactate. All right, here's my first bite. No beef. Oh God, it's dripping. <sighs> Oh my god, I hate my life. <laughs> yeah, it's rough once you remember what cheese tastes like mm -hmm. again. Oh my god, I'm angry. I'm so mad right now. <laughs> but it's great because I appreciate this more than anyone else. Yeah. Oh, no tummy symptoms yet. That lactate really works. But M is here. Where'd she go? She was literally right there. She ran away. I don't know. Snoop's here, as always. He is a dog that will just follow. Oh. Emily opened the door, closed the door, but it didn't close all the way. Hello, can you hear me? I'm in cat, there she is. God, stunning outfit. Show stopping, never been done before. <laughs> Em's here, she came to work early today because she's leaving early and we gotta film a video. We're filming testing ele electronics. I'm gonna show you guys, here's a sneak peek. We're doing a toaster with a window so you can see how toasty your toast is getting so you don't accidentally burn it. A three-in-one portable charger thing. A thermometer that you don't stick under your tongue or your butt. Opportunity missed. <laughs> a smart boss, so this thing that connects to your phone and it can turn off and on light switches for you. You just have to put this next to the switches. And then this is a little scrolly thing. You put this on your finger. Okay, all right. Well, that was, you put this thing on your finger and you connect it to your phone and you can scroll through TikTok and Instagram without having to move your arms, which is great for a huge community of maybe like physically impaired people. Yeah, not as able-bodied. Not as able-bodied. I, I always, I'm always trying to figure out the right termage. Yeah. Let us know what the right termage is. Yeah. 
And I think there's a huge community that could actually use that other than just lazy people. And I've realized that with a lot of products. I've tested a lot of products um, in my day and a lot of them I'm like, who would use this? And I go, oh, there's a huge community of people who probably actually do need this. Mm, okay. And I'm trying to be more aware of that when I, I've tested products as I've gotten older. But oh, Snoop, I love you so much. Your tail's wagging. I can see your face moving because your tail's wagging. Where's my goopy goopy? Where's my goopy goopy? Give me kisses. Thank you. You ready to film? Yeah. Let's do this. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. I'll be right back. No, so after pizza. we had our Mexican pizza, cool. went back to the house. But Emily and I had to shoot a video. You saw that. Wait, you guys saw that. It's fine. We did it. We shot the video. And now, and then a chimney sweep came over. I forgot that I had hired a chimney sweep to clean my chimney because it was very dirty. He did it. Great guy. Gold Coast chimneys if anyone needs one. And then now... It's lunchtime and it's dairy day. So I'm getting pizza, but there are two pizza places I want to eat at. One is called Jimmy Slice. Abby says it's like the best slice of pizza you can get around here. And another is a Medici's pizza, New York style with truffle oil and garlic. So we're ordering them or picking them up really quick because we have to take the little dog to the vet and she has to be there in like an hour. So we're grabbing, look how many dogs are outside. One, two, three, I love this. Anyway, so we're gonna grab our pizza. I think we're gonna eat it in the car again, which is great because then I can eat it in peace. There's music. Oh, here's the first one. Oh, it smells yeah. like roasted garlic and cheese yeah. and grease. Oh, oh, I'm, so I'm so excited. All right, while we're waiting for our Jimmy Slice to be done, I'm gonna have some Medici's here. Okay, here it is. Yes. Mm. Is so it remind you of Italy a little bit? Mm. I mean, it's not as good, but like similar to that place yeah. we went to? Yeah, it just cheese in general now mm. reminds me of Italy. Mm. Truffle oil. Yeah. Ugh, it's so good. Oh, fuck. All right, we moved to the car, and now I'm gonna have a Jimmy slice. Oh my God, that's huge. It is massive. I love it, I'm so excited. Oh, I kinda want ranch with that. Right here. Let's give you the one very far from the meat. Okay, ranch. you're right. Late. Thank you, good sir. You're welcome. Parmesan? I actually don't like Parmesan. Oh, I always forget that. Yeah, and I'm a weird one. All right, do you want a pizza? I'll wait till we eat. I'm one-handed, so I'm gonna... Open. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna have a... I'm gonna wait, because it's hot. Yeah. I want a bite. I at least want a bite while oh, it's hot, so I know. I'm gonna give the day port noise. Yeah. <laughs> Test the, mm -hmm. the, the rating. Mmm, mm, this one's better. Yeah? Mm-hmm. This one is definitely better. Okay, I agree. Oh, man, this is good. I used to get pepperoni peppertini. Ooh. Ooh. It, a little bit of that tang mm -hmm. with, this, with the salty meat was, like, really good. All right. Go ahead, tell them what we're doing. Abby said she saw a light on in the attic the other night, and I've been too scared to look in there. Danny's here. He doesn't know what we're doing this, but his presence here. There is a giant man here. His hand is not broken. <laughs> we're scared someone's living in the attic. Ah! Oh, I thought I'd get you. <laughs> How are you gonna get up there? I just need a stick. There's an attic light is turned on. I just need a stick. I'll get it. Um, what? <laughs> Got it. Yeah. No, you have to see if someone's living up there. Yeah, that's good. I just did. There's no one up there. It's like four foot by four foot, and I can see the whole thing. What if he's lying down under that tube? Yeah. <gasps> There's no one up there. It's been like a week. Have you heard footsteps? No. <sighs> it's also really hot, so they'd be sweating. <laughs> One, pizza was delicious. We took this one to the vet, and then we've just been chilling. I've been doing work. Danny is still hanging out with us. He's our buddy for the night. We've been playing darts. Abby's actually gonna change out my septum piercing into a hoop. Oh, okay. Pickles. Okay, it is painful. Oh, I didn't know that was an actual piercing. Oh, okay, hold on, sorry. That was painful. What did you think it was? I thought it was the hoop thingy that stuck on. You think I've been wearing a fake hoop thingy for <laughs> I, I, six I, I, months? I don't judge. Did it? Yeah. Look good? Uh, I want it closer to your nose. You want me to get a smaller one? Yeah. I gotta get a smaller one. That's how we do it. Yeah. I'm capable. Um, so what does this do? You, sh you should be able to like push down and twist it and open it up. So that that's gonna go in here. Oh, okay, that's just that, that. that piece goes in here. Okay. Um, here, I'm gonna that. Are you sure that that's what this is? Yes, that's that's gonna take this bit. So, oh, now push up on that. Okay. Update. Danny and I tried to fix the shower. It's been broken forever now. We got, we made progress, but did not fix it. I made a vegetable lasagna. 
I love lasagna. Turns out I like meat lasagna. That one, no good. We have had a couple drinks each, which means we cannot drive, and In-N-Out does not deliver. I did not explain that the last thing on my dairy day list was a grilled cheese from In-N-Out. But, so our friends have volunteered to come pick us up and take us to In-N-Out, because I really want to get a grilled cheese. So, dairy day is being a whole fiasco. Also, I beat Danny at darts. I thought that was a piece of important information to put in there. You're welcome. Sorry, that was embarrassing for you and me.